New York City, a place unlike any other, alive with energy and endless possibilities. From the first light of day reflecting off the Statue of Liberty to the hum of the subway beneath bustling streets, this city moves to its own rhythm. Let's experience its timeless beauty. Uncover its hidden layers and feel the heartbeat of its people. Every step reveals a new story, a new surprise, and a piece of what makes New York unforgettable. And just wait, the last stop on our journey is when New York truly reveals its magic. Let's begin our day in New York City with an iconic journey. We'll board the ferry at Battery Park. And as it pulls away from Manhattan, get ready to experience a unique perspective of one of the world's most breathtaking skylines. The towering buildings, the shimmering water, and the hum of the city's energy set the stage as we cross the harbor. The Statue of Liberty, our first destination, grows in view. A symbol of freedom and hope for millions who arrived on these very shores. Once on Liberty Island, we'll walk beneath Lady Liberty herself. At 305 feet, from the tip of her torch to her base, she's both immense and inspiring a gift from France in 1886, and an enduring symbol of American ideals. Inside the Pedestal Museum, you'll find exhibits about her creation, history, and influence. From there, we head to Ellis Island, just a short ferry hop away. This historic immigration station which welcomed over 12 million people from 1892 to 1954, holds stories of dreams, determination, and transformation. As we wander through the echoing halls of the Ellis Island Immigration Museum, it's easy to imagine the mix of excitement and uncertainty felt by families arriving with everything they owned packed into a single suitcase. In the registry room, also known as the Great Hall, visitors waited for hours, anxious to hear whether they could officially start their new lives in America. For many, it was the beginning of a journey that would shape generations to come. After exploring the Statue of Liberty and Ellis Island, let's keep that maritime momentum going by hopping on the Staten Island Ferry. Best of all, it's completely free and it offers one of the city's best views right from the water. As we pull away from Lower Manhattan, we'll be treated to panoramic views of New York's iconic skyline. Skyscrapers shimmer in the daylight, stretching into the sky like a testament to human ambition. The ferry glides past Governor's Island and draws near the Statue of Liberty once more, allowing us one last look at her in all her splendor, standing guard at the entrance to the city. As we dock at Staten Island, we can choose to explore the area or simply stay on board to make our return journey. Either way, the ferry provides a rare chance to soak in the city's beauty without the hustle and bustle. Just the steady hum of the engines, the salty air, and the views that remind us why this is the city that never sleeps. Towering above the Manhattan skyline, One World Trade Center stands as a symbol of resilience and renewal. As the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere, 
it soars to a height of 1,776 feet, offering breathtaking panoramic views of New York City and beyond from its observatory. Just steps away lies a place of solemn beauty and deep significance, the 9-11 Memorial and Museum. Here, we find two immense cascading waterfalls where the Twin Towers once stood. These reflecting pools, each nearly an acre in size, are the largest man-made waterfalls in North America. The water flows endlessly into the center of each pool, symbolizing both loss and renewal, while the names of every person who lost their life in the attacks of September 11th 2001 and the 1993 World Trade Center bombing are etched into the bronze parapets surrounding the pools. Walking along these names, we're reminded of the individuals, the lives, and the stories that form the heart of this memorial. This memorial and museum offer more than a history lesson. They are a tribute to the endurance of a city and its people, and a place where we can pause to reflect on hope, unity, and the power of remembrance. From Lower Manhattan, let's head east towards one of New York City's most beloved landmarks, the Brooklyn Bridge. As we step onto the bridge's pedestrian walkway, we're transported back to the late 19th century when this engineering marvel first connected Manhattan and Brooklyn. Opened in 1883, the Brooklyn Bridge was the longest suspension bridge of its time, a feat of architecture and a symbol of New York's grit and ambition. With its soaring Gothic arches and sturdy steel cables, the bridge creates a stunning frame around the views of both boroughs. Walking or biking across the bridge is more than just a means of getting from point A to point B. It's an experience. To the north, we can spot the Manhattan Bridge with its steel blue structure. while to the south, the New York Harbor opens up before us with the Statue of Liberty in the distance. As we move closer to the center, Manhattan's skyline spreads out behind us, while Brooklyn's neighborhoods and tree-lined streets welcome us ahead. The bridge hums with life a mix of tourists and locals, cyclists and photographers, all drawn to this unique place that unites two worlds. Stepping off the Brooklyn Bridge, we find ourselves in D-U-M-B-O, one of Brooklyn's most vibrant and creative neighborhoods. Short for Down Under the Manhattan Bridge Overpass, Dumbo has transformed over the years from a quiet industrial area to a thriving artsy enclave packed with galleries, boutiques, and cafes. One of the most famous spots in Dumbo is Washington Street, where the view of the Manhattan Bridge is perfectly framed by brick buildings with the Empire State Building nestled in the bridge's arch. This spot has become an Instagram icon for visitors and locals alike, offering an unbeatable photo op with the Manhattan skyline as the backdrop. Dumbo is also known for its waterfront park, Brooklyn Bridge Park. Here, we can relax by the river and enjoy breathtaking views of the Manhattan skyline. As we look across the East River, the skyscrapers of Lower Manhattan rise up, 
their lights glittering in the water as evening falls. The park also features Jane's Carousel, a beautifully restored vintage carousel housed in a glass pavilion, a touch of whimsy that adds to the neighborhood's charm. From Dumbo, let's dive into one of New York City's quintessential experiences, riding the subway. We'll head down into the bustling, gritty underground, where the city's energy pulses through each station. As the train arrives with its familiar rush of wind and rumble of wheels, we step inside to find the true heartbeat of New York a fascinating cross-section of locals, tourists, artists, and professionals, all sharing this fast-moving space. It's a lively, sometimes unpredictable ride, but there's no faster way to feel connected to the rhythm of the city. Soon, we arrive in the heart of Manhattan's Chinatown, and we step up from the subway into a whole new world of sights, sounds, and scents. Chinatown's streets are filled with the aromas of sizzling woks, fragrant teas, and fresh produce from bustling outdoor markets. Vendors sell everything from exotic fruits to handmade dumplings, and colorful signs written in Chinese script line the streets, each storefront a window into a different part of this vibrant neighborhood. Chinatown's streets and alleyways are filled with history, each corner a reminder of the generations that built this community from the ground up. Between the subway's bustle and Chinatown's cultural flair, this journey gives us a look at New York's rich diversity and the many worlds tucked into a single city. From the heart of Midtown, let's take a short walk to two of New York City's most iconic landmarks. First, we'll head north to the New York Public Library's Stephen A. Schwartzman Building on 42nd Street. This historic library is a masterpiece of Beaux-Arts architecture, with its grand staircase, marble halls, and vast reading rooms that feel like stepping back in time. Outside, we're greeted by the famous lion statues, patience, and fortitude, who have stood guard since 1911 and are beloved symbols of New York's resilience. Inside, we can wander through the library's collections, which include everything from rare books and ancient maps to literary manuscripts. Just a few blocks away lies Grand Central Terminal, one of the city's busiest and most beautiful spaces. As we step into the main concourse, it's hard to miss the immense vaulted ceiling painted with a constellation of stars, a stunning touch that adds a sense of magic to the bustling station. From here, we can explore Grand Central's lower levels, where an eclectic mix of dining and shopping awaits, from local bakeries to the iconic Oyster Bar. These two landmarks capture New York's blend of culture and elegance, offering a chance to step into the city's past while experiencing its ever-present energy. Next, we'll head west to Hudson Yards to check out one of the city's newest and most unique architectural landmarks, the Vessel. This eye-catching structure with its honeycomb design and gleaming copper-colored exterior, stands 16 stories tall and is composed of a maze of interlocking staircases. 
climbing up the spiral stairways offers us an entirely fresh perspective on the city, with views of the Hudson River, the High Line, and the surrounding skyscrapers. It's a quick stop, but a memorable one, giving us a chance to experience a modern twist on New York's ever-evolving skyline. Now, let's head south to one of New York City's most famous landmarks, the Empire State Building. This Art Deco masterpiece has graced the city's skyline since 1931. Towering at 1,454 feet to the tip of its antenna. As we step inside, we're greeted by elegant marble and gold details that transport us to the grandeur of another era. An elevator ride takes us up to the observation decks, either on the 86th or the 102nd floor. From this height, the city unfolds in every direction. Central Park's green expanse to the north, the Statue of Liberty to the south, the glittering Hudson River and the Brooklyn Bridge spanning the East River. Day or night, the view is stunning, offering a full panorama of the energy and architectural splendor that defines New York. This stop at the Empire State Building is more than just a visit. It's a moment to soak in the city spirit from above, feeling both the immensity of the skyline and the charm of each distant detail. Just a short walk from the Empire State Building, we find ourselves in Times Square, the dazzling, pulsing heart of New York City. Here, we're surrounded by the glow of neon lights massive LED screens, and a whirlwind of movement as people from all over the world converge on this iconic square. Times Square is a sensory overload in the best way, with Broadway marquees lighting up the streets, street performers drawing crowds, and an energy that buzzes 24-7. This area is more than just a landmark. It's where the excitement of Broadway, the diversity of the city, and the magic of the Big Apple come together. Amidst the glow and glamor of Times Square, we find ourselves immersed in the energy and vibrancy that make this spot the beating heart of New York City. A visit to New York City wouldn't be complete without stepping into the theater district, home to the world-famous Broadway. Here, we're in the heart of New York's cultural identity, where the lights shine even brighter and the excitement of live theater fills the air. Walking through these storied streets, we're surrounded by legendary theaters and marquees advertising everything from long-running classics to the latest hit musicals and cutting-edge plays. Whether we're lucky enough to catch a matinee performance or simply soaking up the buzzing atmosphere, Broadway offers an experience like no other. The energy here is infectious. Fans line up outside theaters, eagerly chatting about the stars and stories that bring these stages to life. The theaters themselves stand as timeless symbols of Broadway's charm, where generations have gathered to experience the magic of live storytelling. After immersing ourselves in the theater lights and energy of Times Square, Let's hail one of New York City's iconic yellow cabs 
to take us uptown to Rockefeller Center. With a quick wave, we hop into the back seat and set off, joining the flow of the city streets and watching as the buildings pass by, each one telling its own story. The cab ride itself feels like a classic New York experience, giving us a moment to sit back and take in the sights as we make our way to one of the city's most beloved landmarks. Arriving at Rockefeller Center, we're greeted by the impressive Art Deco buildings and the vibrant atmosphere that define this place. If we're visiting in winter, there's the magical sight of the massive Rockefeller Christmas tree towering above the plaza, surrounded by twinkling lights. Below, the ice skating rink is filled with people gliding under the watchful gaze of Prometheus, the famous gilded statue at the rink's edge. And if we're ready for more stunning views, we can head up to the top of the rock observation deck. From here, the entire city opens up before us, with Central Park stretching out to the north and the Empire State Building anchoring the view to the south. The perspective from Rockefeller Center is breathtaking, offering us one final panoramic glimpse of the city that never fails to amaze. A short walk from the Rockefeller Center brings us to Central Park, a sprawling, green oasis right in the heart of Manhattan. Spanning over 840 acres, Central Park is a world of its own, where city sounds give way to birdsong, and skyscrapers are replaced by trees, ponds, and wide open meadows. Wandering into the park, we find winding walking trails that invite us to explore its scenic landscapes. We might come across Bow Bridge, with its graceful arching form over the lake, a favorite spot for photos and quiet moments alike. Further along, the peaceful ramble offers a maze of wooded paths and hidden bird watching spots, perfect for a quiet escape. The park's charm lies in its endless variety. Gardens bursting with seasonal flowers, shaded benches beneath ancient trees, and statues like the iconic Alice in Wonderland that add touches of whimsy. And in the winter, the park transforms into a wonderland with ice skating at Woolman Rink, offering picture-perfect views of the city skyline. From sprawling lawns to hidden gardens, Central Park gives us a chance to unwind and take a breath. Surrounded by nature, right in the middle of the city's busy rhythm. Whether we're here for a quick stroll or an afternoon of discovery, Central Park is the green heart of New York, where every path leads to a new adventure. And as the day comes to an end, one last surprise awaits. As night falls, New York City transforms into a breathtaking spectacle of lights and energy. The skyline, already impressive by day, becomes a glittering masterpiece against the darkness. Iconic landmarks like the Empire State Building, a glow with its vibrant and ever-changing light displays. And One World Trade Center, standing tall with its radiant beacon, create a dazzling panorama that captures the spirit of the city. From all angles, New York at night offers moments of pure magic. 
Standing atop the Empire State Building's observation deck, the city stretches endlessly in every direction, a shimmering web of streets and skyscrapers. Below, the movement of taxis, buses, and pedestrians forms a symphony of life, each element contributing to the rhythm of the city that never sleeps. Across the East River, the Brooklyn Bridge sparkles with golden lights, creating a striking pathway that connects the boroughs. Walking across the bridge at night offers one of the city's most enchanting views. Behind you, Manhattan's illuminated skyline rises majestically, while in front, Brooklyn's quiet charm and tree-lined streets come into focus. Beneath the bridge, the East River reflects the city's brilliance like a moving canvas of light. The Statue of Liberty stands proud in the harbor, her torch glowing brightly as a symbol of freedom and hope. From Battery Park, the sight of Lady Liberty against the dark waters surrounded by the lights of passing ferries, is an unforgettable scene of nighttime serenity. In Times Square, the night pulses with energy. The neon signs, massive LED screens, and constant movement create an atmosphere unlike anywhere else in the world. It's a place where day and night blur, and the buzz of excitement never fades. The streets are alive with the chatter of tourists, the performances of street artists, and the glow of Broadway marquees promising unforgettable shows. New York at night isn't just a collection of lights, it's a masterpiece in motion. The grandeur of its skyscrapers, the glow of its streets, the serenity of its parks, and the pulse of its landmarks all come together in a symphony that stays with you long after the night ends. Here, every corner whispers a story, every view ignites awe, and every fleeting moment feels timeless, as if it were crafted just for you. It's a fitting close to today's journey, a final chapter written in the brilliance of this unforgettable city. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you want free travel guides delivered straight to your inbox, scan the QR code on screen now. Thanks for watching. See you next time for another world tour.